Ready, set, hey. Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. We got another Japan crate for the month of June. June. Here we go. We're gonna do an unboxing and taste all the all the treats that we got in it. And uh to get to it, let's, let's jump right into it. Hey, look at that. June. Oh here. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta figure out how to like because everything's gonna be invisible. You know how that goes. <laughs> If you have any suggestions or any like green screen knowledge, hit us with some tips in the comments below. We can't figure it out, so we want to have these backgrounds, but as you can see, boop, this drink is green. But, I, you know, obviously it's not working out. <laughs> I can't figure it out. Also, do some like shades of yellow and stuff like that are not really showing up. This is grass down here, but I guess the yellow is a little bit better than it was last last, last month. You see? Yeah. And that is like a decent yellow. What about the limes and the lemon? The lime yeah, see, good. it's good. Just the greens. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's not bad. Progress. <laughs> we made something. Okay. Ooh. Whoa. We're going to start with these bad Daddy boys right here. Like I think it's a little loud, but it works. Okay, Kaju Gummy Golden Pineapple. Okay, so I picked this up because I saw the pineapple, and I love pineapple. It says it's going to taste like almost eating the real thing, but in gummy form. Mm, I'll be the judge of that. Even concentrated <laughs> fruit juice, these pineapple-shaped gummies are juicy and have the mellow sweetness of the original fruit that makes it like you're almost eating the real thing, but in gummy form. Ooh. It smells good. You toss uh, that That smells exactly like a pineapple. Oh, but like if you were oh, well. open... <laughs> If you were to cut open a pineapple, it's it smells exactly That's like really good. Right. Oh, look at the little pineapples. They're shaped like little pineapples. Beep, beep, beep. Ready? Ready? That's gummy good. up the gummy bear. Oh, mm -hmm. well, that is really good. I like that. That does taste like pineapple really good. Uh -huh. wow. I like they that They nailed a lot. it. <laughs> they really did nail that fucking That's pineapple amazing. flavor. Mm-hmm. Right. Right. Oh, man, that's good. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm going to say right now, this is probably my favorite one out of this. Oh, are we going to do the, the rating? You want to rate them? Like on a scale of 1 to 10? This is a 10. This, this is, is a 10. 10. <laughs> this is I a agree. 10 for sure. Yeah, 10. Okay. <laughs> okay. I love me some pineapple. What's next? I don't know. You want me to pick? Yeah, you pick. I picked this one because this guy's making like a crazy face. Ume um, Plum Candy. Mm. So ume, ume is a popular candy. fruit used in many snacks, candies, and cuisines. In this case, it is used to test your luck with a sour twist. Ooh. Can you handle the sour? So it looks like we're having like a sour box this week. Because like sour, sour. There's a few sour ones. I don't know. Yeah. So I'm going to be making some faces. <laughs> well, I hope this isn't too sour because I, I bit my lip earlier. Rip. Rip. <laughs> Here we go. Ready? Ow. Oh. Oh. Oh, they're hard. You crushed the shit out of that. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Mm -hmm. I didn't get a sour one. They're all supposed to be sour. They're all sour? Mm -hmm. This doesn't taste sour to me. Nope. Maybe. Did you already crunch it up, though, huh? Mm hmm. No, this is very sweet. Mm hmm. So there's a slight sour. It's like very sweet in the beginning. I don't know. I give it a five. I say a six. Like, they're, they're good. They ate. Boom. Strawberry. It's a chocolate, so. Pretzel chocolate strawberry. Chocolate pretzels are a must. This snack pops it with an added crispy texture coated with a sweet and sour strawberry chocolate. The pretzel flavor is adjusted to match the strawberry, making it more compatible with chocolate for a delicious strawberry chocolate pretzel concoction. So they're gonna be sour and sweet? What? Okay. Probably not very sour though. But I don't know how I feel about it. Smell like uh, strawberry and Nesquik. Mm -hmm. It has like a little kick of sour, but not really anything. Yeah. Yeah, like if you weren't paying attention, you wouldn't be able to taste any sour right. in it. It's good though. I give Those it. Those are like, like it's like a seven. 
Yeah, I say like seven too. Oh, that's really good. <clears throat> it's like a little cola bottle. This is a cola gummy. Mm -hmm. It's one of our favorite gummies. This bottle shaped gummy has a refreshing cola taste with a sour twist. Sour. Sour. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I like that. Well, it does taste like cola. So, a lot of the gummies from Japan, whenever they're cola flavored, they really do taste like cola. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's really good. The sour again isn't very sour, right. sour, but it is. It is present, I guess. It's that that sugar that's on the outside, right? Right. right. Kind of like I don't know. I don't I even like want to say. Yeah, it's good. I give that like a like a seven, yeah. like a six and a half, seven. Yeah. Good one. Let's go. Let's keep going. Cola chewing candy gum. If it's gum, we're gonna save it still, yeah. All right, where are we? I want to stay here chewing this gum. Here. Cola soft candy. Feel like drinking soda? Yeah. Feel like eating some candy? Yeah. This candy brings you the best of both worlds with its cola taste in soft candy form. Okay. So, so it's, it's not gum, it is candy. It's just chewy candy. I don't even show the wrapper, I just opened it. <laughs> Oops. Oh, I can't even see it anyways, it's all green. There you go. <laughs> Pow. Let's go. The texture is almost like a little mochi, but not as soft. The flavor. Cola. <laughs> I, I kind of, yeah, kind of. Yeah, right? cola flavor. It's good. It's, it's very, good. I, very soft. I give it like. Give it a five. I give it a five, yeah. <laughs> give it a five. Okay, that's definitely gum. This is a little gum. This is a little penguin with a hat. A little penguin with a hat. Here we go. I, I think it's going. fiction when they wear hats. <laughs> <laughs> Copyright. It is a gum. You're right. What's this? This looks cool. I don't know what it is, though. It's a Ramoon bottle gummy. It says, this gummy <laughs> looks like a miniature <laughs> Ramoon bottle, <laughs> and sure does it taste like one, too. So, so it's a gummy it's candy. A gummy? Tastes right. like Ramoon. Probably this original flavor. A. We should get sponsored by Ramoon. <laughs> and Japan Crate. I'll add us. <laughs> <laughs> if you're you watching this Japan Crate or Ramoon, sponsor me. <laughs> I can't open it. <laughs> Got it. Just peel that right out. <laughs> mm. That's good. That's all right. I give it a, I give it like a, a four for me. Yeah, I give it like a three. Okay. Like it's good. I yeah. like the I like the texture of it, but that flavor is eh. yeah, that flavor is not bad. Like, I'm drinking an original Ramon flavored drink, and it, it didn't really taste like it at all. Mm, I guess it's it's kind of similar. Like I can see, I can, I can see where it'd be like that. But no, I think this is gum. He's sweating. The picture on that though. Let's see it. So it is gum. So we'll save that. <laughs> A package in his. Pretty oh, cool. Oh, he reminds me of a lemon grab from Adventure Time. Adventure Time, yeah. Okay, so... One million years dungeon. <laughs> if it is gum, we will it's save gum, it. Yeah, it's a save. What is this? Pop rocks. Ramoon. More okay. ramoon. Oh, sorbet lollipop cider. <sighs> Dip and lick your taste buds with ramoon cider candy. A fun treat to eat. So like a fun dip. All right. <laughs> yay, yay. There's the back side. Mm. No, not for you? Not for me. Do you like the lollipop by itself? Yeah, the lollipop by itself is a lot better, but the powder, I don't know. I'm not a fan of it. I can't really put my finger on what it kind of tastes like. The lollipop by itself is not sour, so I'm wondering if you were getting like residual sour mm. from the powder. That makes sense. Oh, yeah. The, it's, it's, it's more sweet. Sweet, yeah. Alrighty. Give it a dip. Pop, pop, pop. Give it a dip, dip, and a dip. Oh. Uh, okay. What does that taste like? I know the it flavor, tastes like, but I can't put my finger on it. You know those cheap little gums that you like randomly get on Halloween? Oh, yeah. They don't have a brand, they don't have a nothing. And then they have a really like good flavor for like two seconds, and then they turn into 
like a, essentially a piece of rubber in your mouth. Yeah, I'd put them as, in the same category as like a like a hubba bubba bubble gum. <laughs> you know? I can't believe you don't like it, though. I like it. It's not bad, but I mean, I'd give it a three. It's a three for me. I would give it, I don't know, like a four. Yeah. Sweet potato fries. Hey, Ken, Kenpi, Kenpai is a snack food from Kochi Prefecture, Japan. They are strips of candied sweet potato resembling french fries in appearance, but are hard and sugary sweet in taste. Oh, what? Try it. Um, try it with this on the go snack and let us know what you think. So they're sweet, <coughs> but they look like french fries. They're sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes. Oh. Okay. It's a stale French fry. Yeah. With that's sweet. Sweet. Sweet like yeah, um, honey. Sweet potatoes. Maybe. I can taste the sweet potatoes yeah. in them for sure. Mm -hmm. But like you said, it's like a crunchy, like stale fry, but <laughs> not impossible. Like break your tooth on to eat. Right. I don't know. It kind of tastes like maple. Yeah, that's so why I think like, they're it's good. A candied sweet potato. It is good. I give them a four. I say a four too. Yeah, four maybe five. I'm not, right. I'm not like wowed about them. I don't love it. Yeah. <laughs> I also don't hate it. Like, I'll definitely finish them. Yeah, for sure. What is that? That's cute. I love these little, like, triangular shaped packages. All right. I don't even know which side to show you. I'll show you this side, though. Chocolate coffee. Oh, or coffee keep chocolate. Going that way. Coffee chocolate. Huh? This package is inspired by the nostalgic Tetra Pak coffee milk. The sweets inside are coffee-flavored grain chocolate. That's the perfect mini treat yourself treat. Ooh, there's so like, there's so much air in here. Like I can it's, pop it's it. Firm, right? Yeah. In the little bits of my fingers. So tiny. Okay. Let's try these out. <laughs> okay. Oh. Right off the bat, it like threw me off because they were firm on the outside mm -hmm. and they were soft on the inside as soon as you bit into that you broke that shell it just like coffee coffee like strong yeah. flavored coffee but it's not bad no it's good i like that i can see how you would like like, like a coffee bean you know you knock back a little <laughs> you don't got a cup of coffee just carry this in your pocket and you're good mm -hmm. i like it yeah i like it too that's good i give it an eight yeah i give it an eight i have an eyeball on this and I don't know why, because I don't actually like flan, but mm -hmm. peach parfait Kit Kats are done. Damn! <laughs> I'm excited for that. Mm. Look at that flan. Hell yeah. It's so, it's like holographic. All right. Let's see. Pie no me pudding flavor. These classic mini pie pastries seem to always be a hit. This edition is caramel pudding with a lovely pudding cream centering a flaky but moist pastry pie. Put them in the microwave for a minute to enjoy a real warm treat. In the microwave? Yeah, I don't have a microwave in here. See, that's exactly what those little, the little ones that I did like were like. Pick this out. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it says. But it looks cool. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it smells so good. I'm seeing it. it. Smells like I've smelled that before. It smells like caramel. Is that what it is? Oh man. It is. These are gonna be so good. Oh wait, that one doesn't have any on it. Now I'm not a big fan of caramel, but we'll try it anyways. I love like a honeycomb. Caramel, so I'm ready. Okay, ready? Uh huh. These so, are good. I like them. They're like uh it's also got like a hard shell mm -hmm. kind of this brown part right here yeah it's like a like a caramel coating but as soon as you bite into it it like dissolves in your mouth this is so flaky mm -hmm. like a croissant mm -hmm. <laughs> i don't know if you can see the layers and then it's got like a little itty bitty pocket of cream filling it's right good on. i'd give it an eight mm-hmm mm -mm. It's a nine for me. A nine? I love that. All right. Is, is this the DIY? Mm -hmm, probably. Yes. If so, we'll really save that for later. But it's all green, so you can't see nothing. Cool. This last small that we have. Bottle sour, special quality, huh? Sour bottle candy. 
Ramon on the go and at the palm of your hand. This tiny mini bottle container contains flavored granule Ramon that tastes so yummy. Receive one of three flavors, green apple, strawberry, or cider. So we got pink, so strawberry. Which is good. I like the I like the um strawberry room. <laughs> this is it was like on top. That's pretty cool. I like mm-hmm. that. Sweet, sweet. So what is it? It's just Ramon flavored powder. Not sour. You dissolves right in your mouth. Mm-hmm. Mm. Like, I like in that. there, they're kind of like little like sticks, but. You put it when it lands your your tongue, it just, just yeah disappears, just disintegrates. It's weird because they're bigger like pieces, mm-hmm. but they're less granular than like powdered candy you would get in America treats. It's good. I like it. It's not sour though. It's not no. sour at all. So, Give which I don't understand because when they be doing like oh one of these is sour and the rest of them aren't, they'll, those sour are oh, like sour. <laughs> Mm-hmm. It was good. I gave it a five. I like it. Yeah, yeah. It's really four or five. Okay. Fine. I'm out of my drink, so <laughs> let's go with this. What better time? Okinawa shik sheka shikwasha. Okinawa shikwasha. Uh citrus depressa drink. Green. Can't see it. Quench <laughs> your thirst with this beverage containing whole squeezed fruit juice. And a beverage containing whole squeezed fruit juice that is made by squeezing whole fragrant uh, shikawasa fruits from Yanbaro, Okinawa. The sweet and sour flavors are a nice refresh sweet for your tasting sour. buds. Pair with ice for the perfect summer night drink. It smells like lemonade. It does, yeah. Tastes like lemonade. <laughs> yeah, I like that. That's good. Mm-hmm. It's lemonade. <laughs> Pretty much. I mean, it almost tastes like if Gatorade <laughs> made a, a lemonade flavor, not the yellow, but like... Like an actual lemonade lem- flavor? Uh, yeah, lemonade yeah. flavor. Yeah, that's, that's lemonade. <laughs> it's good, though. It's good. I like it. I'm going to finish that. Shikawasa fruits. Shikawasa Shikuwasha? Shikuwasa. Okinawa. It's from Okinawa. It's from Yanbaru. Now I'm speaking Japanese, so. <laughs> caramel corn. We've got caramel corn peach. Tohato is back at it with another new flavor of their caramel corn. Made with a variety of fruit juice, syrup, and peach juice, each caramel corn is sprinkled with a finishing powder. With the <coughs> refreshing flavor paired with the caramel corn taste, it's the perfect combo for summer. It is summertime. Summer, summer, is summer. it summertime? It's not summertime. Right? It is summertime. It is summertime already. Is it hot outside? It's hot as fuck outside. Summertime. It's like 90, what? 90 some odd degrees outside today? No. Was it really 90 something degrees? Yeah. I know that smell. Peach. They smell like peach rings. And they look like little shrimps. Like but the the Tohato uh, caramel corns are always shaped like this. Have you had peach rings before? No, I like that. The texture is kind of like um, it's that cereal. Big brain time. Big brain. Hmm. I don't know. It tastes like a, some kind of cereal. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know if I like it, but I also feel like I want to have more. Is that weird? No. <laughs> They're okay. I give yeah. them. I give them a three. A three? Damn! I was gonna give them a seven. <laughs> They're pretty good. Taste is subjective. Captain Crunch. That's what it tastes like. Like the, the texture is similar to Captain Crunch. Okay. Or is it not like a... softer. Mm-hmm. They're 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 okay. Maybe I changed my answer from a three to a five. I was like really harsh on them. <laughs> But I typically do like the Tohato caramel corn like things. All right. Did we ever give this one a rating? I don't know. But I'd give it a six. I like it. It's an eight for me. <laughs> I'm a drink. I think it's fine. I wonder if it would be better if it's cold. Yeah, I'm sure it would be. All right. 
don't have any ice though. <laughs> okay. This one has a ton of air. Like I can squeeze it. It feels like Dang, it's like made by Lay's. <laughs> Let's see. Alright, what do we have? Shimi Choco Corn. Shimi Choco Corn indeed. This bag is full of star dot 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 shaped corn snacks soaked in gel delicious choco flavor for the perfect pairing. The texture is light and crispy too that before you know it, dot dot dot, the whole bag is gone. Like, why were not so heavy with the dots on this one? It's literally the only one that's written that way. Oh, that smells good. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna like these. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, right off the bat, this smell is a 10. Oh. Cocoa Puffs, that's what it is. Little stars. Da, 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 da. Little stars. Mm. Oh. That's that's amazing. I love that. So oh, much. That's, that's so a good. Mm -hmm. That's a ten. That's a ten for sure. Oh, those are good. It's like chocolate covered cocoa puffs. Yeah, because it's chocolate flavor on the inside and then it's got like a small coating of actual chocolate on the outside. Oh, that's so good. They're so good. Yeah, it is. Mm. All right. But stop. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, I can't stress it enough. Japanese chocolate. So oh. good. <laughs> All right. Last one. Or I guess we still got the gums. Yeah, but... we got the gums and the DIY. Ta -da. This month's special Kit Kat is Kit Kat, Kit Kat, Kit Kat, Kit Kat, Kit Kat. Peach Parfait. A new edition of Kit Kats is here. Peach Parfait. The pastel pink chocolate is flavored with white peach, and the wafer sandwich peaches and cream filling flavored with peaches, peach and cream powder. For fun, we recommend adding to the freezer for a nice cool chocolate treat during warmer days. You gotta. Okay. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ready? It's so peachy. Mm-hmm. Very. Um, it's very peachy and creamy. Mm-hmm. But it's not like um, like artificial peach flavor. It tastes like if you actually bit into a peach, which is so nice. Peaches and cream. It's real refreshing, it's honestly. Good. It's pretty good. It's a, a, like it tastes fresh and creamy at the same time. It's really good. I like these a lot. I give it a six. That's like an a eight for me, an eight, eight and a half. I like that. Okay. For me, so far. Mm -hmm. Yes. Pineapples. Those pineapples. Slap. Chocolate. Those chocolate. Oh. Oh, I give them a twelve if I could. I'm, I'm running away with you. So good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna find you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting away to Japan so I can buy them on the. Okay, I don't know why I'm struggling though. These wrappers are they're tough. You gotta work for your snacks. Oh, no, no. I'm in. <laughs> you want the other? No. Oh. So we're gonna use some gums for the end here, and then we'll do the DIYs. Okay. So I'm gonna do this little one. Little gum. Cooling chewing gum. Hey, there's a little. The bit perfect the piece of, of gum for summer. As you chew the gum, you'll also feel a cooling sensation, too. How cool. How cool is that? <laughs> How it feels to chew five gum. Ah. <laughs> There's like a little comic in here or something. Oh, oh, it's a little picture. I'll try to hold this as best as possible. Don't our phones have one of those, like, uh, translate? Oh, yeah. We should totally we do should that do so that. we can see what it says. So, right off the bat, that reminds me of, like, a Bazooka Joe. Do you remember yeah. those? Like, shitty little five-cent gums that would um, bring a little comic little with little it. comic books. I miss those. Those were cool. All right, so this is going to be a cooling sensation. Ooh. It smells sour. Yeah, it does. It's good. I like that. It it's, got a, it's got a ram one flavor to it. Like the original. Yeah. So the gum, it's got a, an original ram one flavor. Mm-hmm. It's pretty good. I give it a, I give it a five. It's already out of flavor though. It's a little, little devil guy going like, mm. and then the other little dude down here is getting struck by lightning. Struck by lightning. All right, let's try the sour one. Go with this one. Now. Mm. 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 Mm.
ultra sour lemon chewing. Get ready for your lips to pucker. This super sour lemon flavored bar type gum makes makes ours. I'll be the judge of that. I already know we're in for it. Oh yeah. Are we gonna do the whole thing? Oh my god. What are we what else are you supposed to do? Break it in half? Oh I don't know. I mean it's it's gum? It's gum. Here we go. The whole thing, ready? One, oh, it two, smells sour. Three. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Ah. Uh. Regret. It's still so sour. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's sour as f. Oh, <laughs> I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> it wasn't so bad in the beginning. It's still sour. <laughs> Go bite a lemon. Ah, for like Jesus, I hurt. That's a good Lego. Uh. It's good. I like it. As like punishment. <laughs> mm hmm. That's an experience. Holy shit. I'll never be the same. <laughs> mm, my eyes are like watering. Uh -huh. What the hell? It's good though. So when you go to Wingstop and you get the Atomic Hots, <laughs> it's like, you just want to have that heat. It's like, this is, yeah. this is that sour. If you just want to blow your mouth out with sour, there. You got it right here. You don't have to get through the, maybe this one's sour, maybe this one's not. Like, you nah. know, you get a you get a, a package with this guy on it right here. Mm-hmm. Lemon grab. Look at you sweating. I feel your pain, little lemon head man. Mm. Mm. I like it though. I'm gonna give this one a seven. It was fun. <laughs> I'll give it a seven. Fun. <laughs> I'm, it's already out of flavor though. I mean, it still has flavor, it's just like not not like so ridiculous. Either it, mine's out of flavor or I can't taste I can't taste anything. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Last one. DIY. It's all green. I gotta figure out this green screen. Yeah, that. I that, don't know how much. Yeah. That, that lemon was. It's good though. I mean, that's true to flavor. That tastes like lemon. Yeah. It's good, but. If you want to see what it's like? Go and grab a lemon and just take a bite out of, out of it. <laughs> You'll feel our pain. The flavor's on point. It's just that obviously it's sour. Okay. You... That's funny. Okay, so I was puckering last time I was eating this. Yeah. And now it's sweet, just because I can't feel sour anymore. Okay. So we've got a little cup with a with a straw. Right? And we got this green powder. I don't know if it's going to show. Oh, it does. Nice. Hmm. So it's just to pour this into the cup. Cup. A little more than halfway. A little more than halfway. Science. There. That sounds that looks good to me. Okay. Mix, 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 mix. Mix, 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 mix. Until what? Until it's gooey. Until it's gooey. <laughs> okay. Uh says mix, mix, mix with the straw and watch it turn sticky. Okay. Mm, get the blender. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's but I assume good. that it gives you a straw for a reason. Here, let me see. Are we supposed to drink this? Google it. I'm gonna try it. That's funky. I don't I know like if the, I want to try that. I like how the taste is, but I... That texture could... Uh... Oh, yeah, duh. Drinking jelly melon. Oh. We're done. 
Let me give it another go. Yeah. No. That's a no for me, dog. <laughs> mm mm. That's that's melon flavored. Yeah. yeah it's... So the taste is fine. If you were to drink a cup of Jello. But like it's too watery. Yeah. Like it hasn't set all right. the way. It's it's. Nah. It's a it's a that's a. This is like a two. Yeah. Or that's three. like a one or a two for me. I'm gonna go with the one. Cause I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna go for a second sip. Cause that was not okay. <laughs> As it sits, like it's setting up more and more. It's weird. I kind of like it. No, that's a no for look, me. Look, look, watch, watch the drop. Oh, what the hell? Watch, watch as it plops into the drink. Whoa. You can see it on top for a little bit. Show? Nope. <laughs> I guess I can't show you. Like I'm gonna read it all. <laughs> oh well, it's it's. Mm. It's like what? It's getting thicker as time goes on. Here, have another sip. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> now it's just getting hard to like get through the straw. No, I don't like that. <laughs> like I said, it's the texture of like a a Jello that hasn't set fully, and then it's just lemon flavored and not lemon melon melon. Melon flavored, and I don't like it. Like the green moon. Was that everything? That's everything. We oh. we reached the end. That was pretty quick, huh? Japan mm -hmm. create speed run. Japan create. Japan create. Okay, that was it. And that's well, the end of that. Thank you guys for watching. If you watch to the end, thank you. <laughs> yeah, thanks. <laughs> thanks for sticking in there with us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, if you guys liked the video and want to see more content and more Japan crates. Leave a like. Leave a comment down below. Yeah, if you Subscribe. have any suggestions. <laughs> any suggestions? Leave them down below. We get the Japan crates every month, so we'll be doing this once a month. Yep. And until next time. Peace. Peace.